And if I have to eradicate every single piece of scum like I did to Pandorino at Famniversary 4, then let this be the example. <laughs> Yet comes Pandorino, the insane lunatic, and he wants payback, and here comes the familiar security, and they're going to feel the pain of Pandorino! Oh god! Steel chair, and they're gonna- Wait a minute now, Rafazo! Rafazo, coming out of nowhere! What? Oh no, oh no. Oh wait a minute now. Pandorino was Tesla all for himself! Oh god! And he takes him down! Rafazo didn't appreciate that one, I think. He just wanted Tesla. He wanted to make a statement in the hardcore division. And he takes on Pandorino now, what? And now these two are about to get into it in this ultra prompt to battle! And Tesla right now, being as devious as he is. Counting his lucky stars because of the situation has a window to escape the battlefield. The smart man, look at that. High telling it, getting it out of here. Oh, wait a minute. And now it's again Pantorino comes back out from the grave and takes down Rafaso. I don't know what the whole origins of the story is. Who, who, who wants to be here when these two crazy people are doing this? But nonetheless, he has a win over the founder, and Pandorino is setting him up for the muscle buster! And nails it! This is a sign and a declaration of the hardcore war! At Famniversary, I set my world on fire and made the statement of a lifetime when I defeated one of the men who founded this movement. Many of you doubted me. A lot of you said that I wouldn't be able to get the job done and that I was nothing more than just another henchman for Rannick. <laughs> well, shall we check out the scorecard for the results on that? Killswitch and Sander, they lost. Darren and Bickle, not only did they lose, but they are also gone from this place. Not even our mighty leader, Rannick, was able to walk out of that event with a victory. The reality of this situation is that Rannick's army walked into that event with all the momentum in the world, and within the blink of an eye, in the grand scale of this universe, my crazy ass was the only person who was able to walk out with any sort of victory. That is what you call a statement. But making statements can go one of two ways. You can either be the guy making the statement and setting yourself above the rest, or you can be the guy on the receiving end of a statement. Not only did I make my own statement at Famniversary, but I was also on the receiving end of one. A statement put into effect by AWOL. A statement put into effect by Darren Dastanley. Well, <laughs> that's definitely. On that cold, faithful evening in October of last year, where our paths crossed for the very first time, you had a choice to make. When you were sent into the locker room area with the intention of causing as much chaos as you possibly could, you made the choice to target me. You made the choice to make your statement on me. And with that, you made the biggest mistake of your life. Because I will not be the one to roll over and accept your efforts to make a statement on my behalf. Instead, you made yourself an even bigger target than you already were and gained 100% of my total undivided attention. Your little sneak attack was not chaos. Come, Silver Fun Day, whether it be tables, candlesticks, or chairs, I will show you the true meaning of chaos. Hey, what the fuck is your problem, you stupid ass mother How dare you stick your nose in my business? I appreciate that you may have a problem with that son of a bitch, but to come at me like you did at the family words, well, 
That is just damn right stupid. You think you're crazy? You think you're chaotic? Well, those just sound like fancy words for hardcore. And you can bet your f***ing clown ass that you sure as hell are not more hardcore than me. And you know what? I'm gonna prove that to you once again. Right f***ing now. can't say that I didn't warn you guys! Look! I told you! I told you all to just freaking drink a Red Bull, chill your beans, and don't let things just get out of control! But you hardcore maniacs just won't listen, will you? So instead, I'm going to let you blow off some steam in a little match ahead of Cyber Fam Day! So you know what? Get ready, because the king of hardcore, Pantorino, We'll go one on one with the chaotic clown Rafazo in an upcoming FAM live event near you. And if you don't like that, well, here's a song for you. Give me that. And a one, and a two, and a. <laughs> I'm getting better, am I? Oh, 